welcome to another amazing day in Iceland. This day we start in the Glaumbayer Skansen. I don't know if you know the word of Skansen, but they are old buildings where the people lived before. <music> very small and very isolated because Iceland is a very cold place and they didn't have wood to make fire inside the houses so they slept together to keep e each other warm and also in the bigger building where they had uh, who had uh, animals also the animals were on the ground floor and the heat they gave went up so the people slept up on the stable or something like that to have a little bit warmer space. It was really 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 hard to live here decades or hundreds of years ago. After the Skansen we will go to Akureyri which is a big city <laughs> in an Icelandic way but not a real big city in our European or US way and I hope we will have time to go around the city because the most important thing to go some shops to buy some clothes because our packages didn't arrive yet I mean still didn't arrive yet We arrived to Akureyri which is a big Icelandic city, but it's only a small town for me. But we will go around and have a nice coffee before we stop to buy more stuff because our baggage is still not with us. But uh, we try to focus on the things. I mean, I don't really like the cities, you know. I prefer to be in the nature, so I just walk through and go for a coffee and survive <laughs> the city experience. That's it about uh, Akureyri, to be honest. Walking street, sea with a harbor and this church. And if you are interested in more, you can find some museums here like the motorcycle or aviation museum or industrial museum just walk that way museums will be on the way the kiddos uh, stopped me filming them but uh, I think it's very nice that they are working you know in their own city it's uh, they are part of the community and uh, they have a community which is great I live in a capital city, you cannot, so it's uh, very nice. Finally back to the nature, which means an awesome place again. This is it. The Godafoss waterfall, waterfall of gods, and I think you agree with me if it's awesome again, I know something in Iceland. And now I will go to check it from the other side. the third time I visit uh, Iceland and I am still so amazed I am still in love with the island and <laughs> I don't want to talk too much 
just <laughs> watch the pictures that's enough guys come and visit Iceland if you didn't do yet and be amazed you will be amazed and I hope I can give you good tips what to do in Iceland so follow me on the rest of my trip thanks we just arrived to the last stop of the day which will be uh, I think maybe you can see but doesn't matter I will show you from the inside is a thermal bath so come and have some wellness with me the bath was awesome and relaxing and I am relaxed now and arrived to the hotel which is very close to the Mivaten lake and completely next to a lava field for sure it's already dried it's not so hot anymore I am still in love <laughs> oh my god